It's spring in the scrubland of South Africa. The height of the night adder mating season. Despite its name, this snake is active throughout the day, mainly looking for frogs. Luckily for the frog, this male has a different quarry in mind. He's looking for love. And he's in luck. Nearby, a basking female is ready to mate. And she's letting everyone know by releasing a pheromone from glands on her back. She's leaving a chemical trail that lets males know she's ready to mate. As the male crosses her path, he catches her scent trail. He uses his tongue to taste the chemical signals. Reptile sex pheromones are made of fatty molecules that are too large to diffuse through the air as vapor. Instead, they fall to the ground in the female's wake and are only detected by direct contact with the male's tongue. His tongue flicking transfers the scent to odor receptors in the roof of his mouth. It sends a signal to the brain, deciphering the smell. Bingo, a female that's ready to breed. The message is aimed only at males. A female snake picking up another female's odor will ignore it. Once the male catches up, he puts the moves on her. Sliding all over, rubbing his chin against her and touching her with his tongue. Up close, he picks up more of her personal stats. But now that he has the full picture, he doesn't seem so interested after all. She may not be old enough for him. However, the male picks up another trail. Each female snake has its own pheromone signature. This female's pheromones suggest she's much bigger than the first, almost three feet long, about as big as a night adder gets. And he can tell this just from her scent. The older and larger the female, the more saturated fats she produces. And this female is definitely sending the signal he's been hoping for. He smelled his way to a fine romance. <laughs>